Hi, Cancer. It's Elle here to do your weekly reading. Thank you for being here. Thank you for liking, sharing, commenting, and subscribing to the channel. It means a lot. Please continue to do so. All links are below if you need to get in contact with me. Let's get into it. Thank you, God, for blessing uh, Cancer with a clear, concise message from you. All right, so Cancer, the first card out, we have adjustments are required. So what does this card mean? This card talks about... Of course, you need to reevaluate uh, the situation. Also, it talks about all is not lost, okay? So maybe you feel like all is lost or it was lost or it's not going to happen or it can't happen, but all is not lost, okay? They want you to release and trust. That's all you can do right now. You can't force it. You can't manipulate the energy. Just release and trust the process here. It says that trust is needed to move this situation forward. Um, something new and exciting is around the corner for you. Just know that for some of you, your life is out of balance and this may be causing a bit of issue. It's just time to hatch a whole new plan. Some of you have been trying to hang on to this old thing and just hang in there. It's time to, you know, tear the paper out of the notebook, ball it up, throw it away and start something new. Okay. It's time to start over. Um, it's just changes here. It's, it's not lost um, or loss, um, but it is change. Okay. And it says a change of course is forecast. So you might just get some course correction or go this way. You thought it was going to go this way, but it's going to go that way. Um, but it's going to turn out well for you. Um, you could be going through somewhat of a crisis right now, but it's just to remind you that it's time to let go and also pay attention. Um, just pay attention to what's going on around you. Pay attention to energy, um, you should have seen this coming or you, you, you could have already saw it coming here. All right. So that's what we have there. Let's see what's going on for you. Cancer. How's cancer coming into the reading? How is cancer coming into the reading? How is cancer coming into the reading? All right. The emperor. Very nice. So that could be you cancer. You could have, um, Aries in your chart. A uh, Taurus, Scorpio, um, so coming in very solid, very dynamic. If you're a masculine energy, then you, you in your throne, you've built your empire. You're looking for maybe your empress, the person that you will mate with for life. It looks like there's an eagle there. The eagle's mate for life. Um, so maybe you're looking for your mate or you've already found your mate. Um, but you're just not sure how things are going to turn out. It says, uh, don't be so rigid. Uh, the emperor is stern, rigid, and, you know, set in his ways. He's like a square, you know, it's solid, stable, you know, it's solidarity, just unmovable. But the cards say adjustments are required. So you're going to have to be flexible. You have to understand that things may not go in the particular way that you um, wanted them to go. So you're going to have to kind of, uh, you know, get out of your comfort zone, um, get into that adjustment. It says that, and you know, really great things are on the other side of this. Um, what is cancer not seeing here? What is, what is cancer not seeing in this situation, this life situation? What is this? What is cancer not seeing? What is cancer not seeing? What's, okay. Whoa. So you're not seeing yourself, the chariot. You're not seeing um, that maybe you need to be a little bit more balanced or maybe that you're a little too focused on achieving goals, you know, um, maybe work, work related issues. Um, is you, you're on the go, 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 go. Maybe there is no balance here with the chariot. It's, it talks about military and being militant or just getting it done. Uh, the underdog, uh, achievement, taking something in a new direction and this card talked about adjustments maybe course correction so it's maybe that you you need you need to have trust in order to see this move in the direction that you want it to move in uh cancer um so let's see what is the advice for cancer the knight of cups let yourself fall in love let yourself be in love let yourself be taken care of um let your heart sing um with the Nine of Cups, it talks about um, let you know, the universe, let spirit uh, speak to your heart. It talks about downloads. It talks about um, accepting invitations or giving one, dating, courting, making something happen, planning, pre-planning. Some of you have been too rigid, too stern, too stuck in your ways. 
Therefore, if it doesn't go your way, then you're out. If somebody doesn't get on your, you know, the terms of what you want, then you're done. Some of you, this is a very controlling energy, a very controlled and very controlling energy. And it's a very, um, maybe even selfish one because the chariot talks about um, self-directed energy. So maybe some of you need to learn how to be a little bit selfless um, and allow yourself to give more um, and receive love. Okay. Uh, what's the outcome here for cancer outcome? All right. The five of pentacles. Um, maybe you're going to see that maybe the outcome here is maybe lack of confidence in forward movement. We talked about that in the adjustments cards. Let's clarify the five of pentacles, the nine of cups. See, you have the lack of confidence that things are going to move in the right direction, but the card says adjustments are just required because there's something great on the other side of this. You're going to get what you want, wish fulfillment. It also says make a wish. It could very well come true for you right now. You're going to get emotional fulfillment emotional stability you're going to get what you want what you've been wishing for hoping for what you want but you're going to have to sacrifice something with the hangman and it might even be um your perception or how you perceive things or um it, it might even be uh your attitude or an attitude adjustment here with the hangman you're going to have to look at yourself and see how you can get what you want um, out of particular person, place, or thing, but you're going to have to have some adjustment within you. This is what I have for you, Cancer. If it resonates, go over to the website, book there, ask a question or two by texting it to the number below. You can also donate to the channel by clicking the buy Ella coffee link. You can also uh, catch me live every Tuesday, Thursday, and Sunday night, 9.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Thank you, Cancer. Many blessings to you. Take care.